Hey, boys and girls. So, guess what? In just a few days, some of you are going to get to be here on campus at school. We are so excited. It's been so long since we've seen all of you, and we can't wait to see you. Now, we've talked all week how some of the school year is going to look different. When you get to school, you're going to see all of your teachers and Miss Polanco wearing a mask. It might look a little bit scary, but don't worry. We've all got some really cool masks to wear that have fun designs. And what they're used for is to keep you guys safe. I know that normally when we get to see each other, we love to give hugs and we love to give high fives and fist bumps. But that might be a little bit different this year, too. So in order to keep you guys healthy, we're going to have to change some of our greetings. We're going to have to change some of the ways that we say hello. We're going to read a story today that helps us learn what we can do to say hi and to give greetings. So we're going to call this Greeting My Teachers and Friends. When I'm at school, I usually greet my friends and my teachers. We used to give high fives, hugs, and handshakes. They were our favorite. But there's a virus going around the world right now. It's called coronavirus. And coronavirus, it can make people feel sick. It can make people feel yucky. In school, we will not touch each other during greetings. This will help prevent us from getting sick. So we're going to do our absolute best to keep all of our hands to ourselves. But we're going to get creative. And we're going to find new ways to greet one another. We can give air hugs. Air hugs where we give ooh, like that. A big giant bear air hug. Ooh, one of Miss Samplasky's favorites. We can wink at each other. Yeah. We can greet with spirit fingers. We can wave at each other. You guys are so good at waving at each other. I see you do it every day on Zoom. Another way we could greet each other is by Bowing. Ooh, that could be kind of fun. We could bow to each other. Or we could do a curtsy like a princess. If we're wearing hats, we can tip our hat to each other. Another way to greet without touching is to say namaste. People do this in yoga. There's no touch at all in those greetings. That's a good thing. There's also some greetings where you touch a little bit, but not with your hands. So some people like to kick their feet together, but very, very gently. We can do a hip bump. We can also do a elbow bump. Or we can do a foot bump. Greeting each other at school, it's going to look a bit different this year. But it'll be fun to learn new ways to greet each other. So guys, there's going to be so many fun ways that we can still say hi. We can greet. We can wave. We can use our spirit fingers. We can give air hugs. We can Wink. We're going to get creative. It might look different, but guys, we are so excited to see you all again, and we can't wait to have a great school year. I hope you all have the best weekend, and for some of you, I'll see you in person on Tuesday. The rest of you, I can't wait to see you again online. Bye, guys.